There are different ways couples could resolve their conflict. And one of the ways I will recommend is to engage in a healthy argument or a healthy fight. A healthy fight is when you call your partner and you sit together and you talk about the things that your partner is doing that makes you to be angry. You may have bottled up all these things over a period of time. Uh, it may be built on assumption. It may be things that are evident. It may be things that the other person said. And uh, you are so angry. And as a result of that, you want to talk about how you feel. It could result into an argument. And it could be a healthy argument. Sometimes such arguments are essential in order to drive home certain points in your relationship. And at the end of the day, build that relationship and make it become better. A healthy fight can introduce a very healthy relationship. Now, there is a guideline to engaging in a healthy fight in your relationship. No matter the approach you use that works for you, but for no reason should you allow the fight to enter a danger zone that I call the offense zone. I'll define offense from three different perspectives. Number one, I will define it in the realm of sports. I will define it as a legal concept and I will define it as an English word. As a sport, two teams confront each other. They attack each other with one motive to score goals or to score points. In the legal profession, offense is when you break a law. When you commit a crime, it is a felony. When you do something, against the law of the land. Absolutely, that attracts a punishment. And as an English word, offense is when you hate someone. Offense is when you have resentment towards someone. Offense is you are angry towards someone and uh, you don't mind that the person gets destroyed. In fact, when you nurse offense towards someone and we, we are able to x-ray what is on your mind, sometimes it could be that this person is destroyed because you hate that person. You do not vocalize offense, but it's something you nurse in your heart. The Bible also talks about offense that we should make sure it does not come because when it comes, everything goes wrong. Offense does not seek to resolve a conflict. Take note of that. Offense seeks revenge and not to resolve any conflict that is there. Now, why I encourage that couples to engage in healthy fights, it is essential to guide against that level where hatred comes in. In fact, it is essential you initiate your healthy fight as soon as possible so that it does not degenerate into offense. Most times, when you bottle up what your partner has done to you wrongly, something that you perceive is done intentionally, you just assume that this person is doing this thing deliberately and it is hurting you. The moment you leave it to lie there for a long time, there is no how someday it will degenerate and become an offense. And once offense enters, it's like the devil coming in into a home. Because unless the other person pays for what he or she has done to you, you do not get relaxed. Offense is a deadly thing when it enters a relationship.